This modern cabin in Gatlinburg, Tennessee overlooks the Great Smoky Mountains and provides an unforgettable experience. So we're going to be giving you a full tour of this beautiful place and show you what it's like to stay here in the Smokies. And as a bonus, we're going to take you to our favorite place to eat downtown. We are here at the Vejas Cabin in Gatlinburg, Tennessee and wait until you see the views inside. So when you first arrive, you drive up your own private driveway and come across this bridge into the cabin. So the first thing that you notice when you walk inside is this grand open floor concept with a vaulted ceiling leading all the way up to the floor to ceiling windows with an incredible view. Honestly, the focal point of this entire place. Right when you come in off to the side, they actually have something that we've never seen a host provide for guests. And that is day packs. So you can go hiking with their day packs. They've got some binoculars, hiking poles even, as well as compasses. So they really want you to adventure, especially because we're here in the Smokies. And they even have little pamphlets on the dining table for kids to look through that has to do with flowers and stars and just everything adventurous. Moving this way into the kitchen. This kitchen has beautiful white countertops with contrasting black backsplashes as well as black cabinets with gold touches it is very aesthetically pleasing in here. They also have loaded it with everything that you need to cook a meal, including an oven, stove top, microwave. They have this huge deep sink and then the rest of the appliances and things are actually hidden within the cabinets, including the trash can, the dishwasher, and even the fridge. Like how cool is that? <laughs> and then they have plenty of storage for all the utensils that they provide and the dishware. So again, a beautiful kitchen with a large island overlooking that view at the end of the space. Right across from the kitchen is a little outdoor patio with a couple of chairs and a table perfect for enjoying a meal with the view out on the balcony. By the way, if you're a host of an amazing Airbnb, we would love to work with you so you can reach us at journeymore.com and just fill out the contact form. Right here is the long dining table with six chairs to fit everybody for that delicious meal you're gonna cook in that kitchen. <laughs> and then it keeps flowing over into the modern living space. You've got a couch and a few chairs to enjoy the TV, the gas fireplace, and again, the view. Moving this way, we've got the first master bedroom. If I stay here, I would choose this bedroom because those windows are also floor to ceiling and make for a great view when waking up in the morning. <laughs> Trust us, we know. <laughs> in here, they have a queen bed with a couple of side tables and even a charging station for your phone, some cute decorations, and then we're moving into our very own master bath. So this is the master bathroom with a rainfall shower and super modern touches again. Very clean, crisp, sleek look. I love it. Mm -hmm. And all of the tile is really awesome. On to the deck. And not only are there spaces to enjoy the view from inside, but also outside. So there's beautiful weather like today. You can sit in these cozy rocking chairs and just take it all in because it's truly awesome. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like this video, especially if you like unique Airbnbs and adventure. We'd love to take you along with us. Let's keep going. Back past the kitchen, we've got another bathroom on the first floor. Again, a beautiful bathroom with modern finishes and another rainfall shower head. And now we go downstairs. <laughs> So down here is another living space. You've got a super comfortable couch that can double for two sleeping spots. You can sleep on the couch and there's also a trundle bed that pulls out. Right across from it is TV for entertainment as well as some games. And then in this closet, a wonderful touch that I always love, a washer and dryer. So the first room off to the right is the kids' bedroom that has 
four bunk beds so you can bring the whole family with you. The host wanted to create a camping feeling in this room for the kids, so that's why they've got trees and bears and the eagle in the sky on the wall, as well as a little lantern for each bed that the kids can turn on with a shelf and an outlet, which is super thoughtful. Let's keep going. This is the last bathroom. It is very similar to the other two. However, the floor flows all the way into the shower, which is really neat. Back this way. In here is the second bedroom. This one also has the gorgeous floor to ceiling windows for an incredible view during your entire stay. It's another clean bed with a couple of vanity fixtures and a nice dresser to place your stuff. And now Hayden gets to show you the really neat things about the outside. The outdoor space here at the Vejas is a really special spot. The host Mike is actually an architect that specializes in modern design and that's why you have this structure. The way that it looks, all of the edges and the really sharp look was conjured up by him. And his wife is an interior designer who has more of a traditional style and so they put the two together and created this amazing space. But back behind me is one of their favorite spots here at this Airbnb. This is the courtyard area. You've got a huge L couch with a massive flat screen TV and the house actually overhangs it so you can sit out here and enjoy this in any type of weather and then back over here is definitely one of the more fun spots. This is where we've got tons of games like cornhole with custom cornhole boards, Jenga and then a giant connect for and of course a fire pit to be out here and enjoy the weather. And then back behind me this is actually the original retaining wall of the house that was here that burned in the 2016 fires. And so they've really taken this, used what was left, and created a space that is just beautiful. If you wanna book this place yourself, we will leave a link in the description below. I did not. <laughs> Pretty sure I'm undefeated in Jenga, so I'm just gonna keep the streak going. There we go. Aren't we supposed to stack them back on top? Is that how you play? I think so. to my record. Oh. This is some chicken tiki masala over some rice. So we're excited. We are now headed to bed early because we gotta get up early to make it to our favorite breakfast place here in Gatlinburg or else we'll have to wait four hours to get in <laughs> and we don't want to do that. It may be early, but Crockett's is worth it. So excited. 
So excited to be here right now. <laughs> Got our newspapers. <laughs> this is the ultimate breakfast. Literally has everything you could want in one breakfast, including the legendary griddle cake. Literally an inch and a half thick pancake. <laughs> it's incredible. <laughs> The best bite of this whole pancake is the very middle of it, right underneath the butter. <laughs> One last thing before we leave. <laughs> Don't forget, please subscribe to our channel, especially if you love amazing Airbnbs and adventures. Go check some of them out and let us know what you think. <laughs> I'm so excited to show them this place. It's amazing. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Ready? I don't know how to say it's cool without saying it's cool. I need the vocabulary lesson. <laughs> and she'll look hot, so. <laughs> we done. We done. We done. We done. We done. Woo!